Two weapons out of here, Mio two weapons. There we go. This was the weapon to bring. Without a damn doubt. I have the fucking robot slayer here. Make it past a few lasers and a human thinks it's invincible. Yeah, take another look. I'm not exactly human. God damn, I took him out of the fight so fucking fast. I take that. Oh hell yeah. Nice, three AI core, AI core so far. Alright, sweet. I'm gonna go drop all that stuff off. I make it fucking back alive. Alright, two more weapons collected. That means I have a total of five of them. Ooh, that'll do it. The master works all, you can't go wrong. Oh hell yeah, now I'm stupid fast. I'm fast as fuck, boy! Clean Bean had now collected more magnificent weapons and things to help him study to better understand the world around him, for better or for worse. These joys were cut short, however, as an old familiar pain started once again, stronger and more vicious than ever before. For Lean Bean, the pain from cuts and blows he received from his victims and opponents brought him a strange pleasure as part of his passion for combat, but this pain was becoming debilitating. His head throbbed deeply as if it was ready to explode. He had two choices before him. Weather it out again in hopes of it stopping, or find the source of this torment and destroy it. He had freed his mind from the Queen's effects. Whether it was intentional on her part or not, it'll never be known. But regardless, he was free, and his mind was open again like never before. But this action would have unpredicted and lasting effects. Not only did he free himself from torment, but in doing so, 
He also severed the ties of all the Hivers under the Queen's control, indirectly killing almost all of them, saving the few that may survive the pheromone withdrawals as he himself did. He had genocided almost all of his very own people. swam back to shore, where the effects of his actions would be seen immediately. Holy crap. In the time it literally took me to go over here and kill the queen and dump her in the ocean, there are literal patrols of fucking southern hivers here already. God damn. I don't think I've ever seen the hives over here taken over by the southern patrols, so... Well, let's see what I got myself into. Killing the Hive Queen may have upset the balance of the world very slightly. No Hive! Meets for the King! She sacri- Stop giving us no Hive! We just want your meats! And you run to the booty and give it a smack and then he turns around cause he ain't know what happened. Mother King, get a pump and a kit to it, the run, better run. I'm throw my gun. You're about to see the most fucked up Amazon delivery same day shipping ever. Dude, I've never seen this building. What? This is the coolest dude. Oh, what? Are you serious? Is this literally... What? There's little paths? Damn, they love this fucking faction. Now this is like the most unfillery feeling faction ever. Elite drone guard. Oh my fucking god. What the fuck is that? Who the f- What in the fuck is this thing? That's the king? Oh! I gotta try. Oh my god, this is fucked. I did not know what I was walking into. I'm um, excuse me, I am here for the king. Oh, fuck. That's the queen of the hive, and it looks like a normal hiver. Looks like the other one. Uh, the queen wants some herself. What weapon does she have? I just got a downer. Oh my god, I did it. Oh my god. Okay, I did it. I might fucking yoink that real quick. You can't keep getting away with this! Oh, they're mad. There's a little safe in here. This is the coolest shit I've ever seen in this game. I can't believe I've never taken time to come over here. Where's the feeding grounds, fellas? Yeah, there we go! Get him, boy! Get him! No wonder I've never been here. This place is fucked. Uh, let's see where they put me. Sacrifice. Where the hell are you taking me? Is that intruder out? No, find him put in cage. Oh, just a sink. There's poles way out here. I gotta, you know, get the fuck out of here. Alright, let's see what happens when I put them on the pole. Oh, it died. That one hit was enough to do it. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, the the king thing approaches to eat him. He's walking over. He, I think he is. Oh, he's going straight for the queen. Holy shit, he's going wild. Oh man, he's getting eaten as f- <laughs> He's fucking getting eaten. 
What the fuck is it doing? What the fuck is it doing? It's... It, it, I'm out of- I'm, I don't have words, hang on. Let me recompose myself here. It's running at me! <laughs> I've been getting hit a lot, as you can see, because I'm at 84 fucking defense. 96. Toughness. And then I have the same strength and dexterity somehow. Alright, time to collect my next Mewtwo weapon. Oh boy, they're ready to rock as soon as I approach. See how good they fare against the chop techniques. You want to get away with this? Let's see where this, uh... So this Mewtwo weapon is. I'm here to make a withdrawal. Your weapon. Yeah. Fuck Jesus, I love that swing. Oh, let's strip some of the, ar the armor off of some of these guys, because they're going to be getting up soon. I don't want to fight them all again. Oh shit, they knocked me out when I went to go turn off my alarm. I think they- so, since my weapon's so big, I think- yep, they just left it out there. I'm going to have to go back down and get it, but... Inevitably, attacking a prison, I've ended up in it. Oh. There's a lot of people in here. Whoa. There's a southern hiver in here. Y'all forgot to take my backup sword. Fucking idiots. Oh, let's not forget the cleaver. I don't know what I'd do without that thing. There we go. Thought I'm fucked. Oh, damn it! It was the I was that the same fucking guy that downed me last time. <laughs> All right, he took my cleaver and my backup sword, but he forgot to take up my uh, my backup backup not sword but stick. <laughs> Idiots! <laughs> you should always assume I have a backup backup weapon. Right. Where's the hiver? Where's that piece of shit? I've killed too many people with that sword to lose it. Hey asshole. That he's wearing it on his hip. He's shit. Alright, you're gonna figure out that this cage is literally a fucking uh the cage is a suggestion. Oh, I got something special for you. You forgot my backup, 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 backup weapon. The Fist of Doom. But sock the fuck out of this. No. Nope. Alright, let me just grab this bad boy. There you have my sword. Bitch. Letting these awful men out of jail. <coughs> Anyone lock this cage? Imagine being a bandit and not being able to unlock your own cage. I owe you shit. I promise you I'll come in useful. Oh. Get the shackles first. And now the most important one. I am free. Ha 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 ha. I'll kill everyone. You! You have caused me so much fucking issues. Son of a bitch, get back here. Whoop his ass. Holy shit. Yo, but I got some fucking hands. Jesus. Clean Bean had freed and watched all the prisoners run off to cause havoc, as was his intent. 
They would rapidly spread word of his bloodshed and further his infamy. They said their uneasy thanks and returned to their presumed lives of crime, rapidly putting distance between them and their strange savior. All of them but one. Esfer was starstruck upon seeing the bodies of the guards littering the floor. The same ones that mistreated him and tormented him for years in that prison. Last time he had seen a proper corpse was when he had slayed his late master in cold blood. Who was a strange tall hive that freed everyone like some sort of hero? How could one person slay so many? If Esfer himself was that strong, he could never be abused or stuck in a prison again. A golden opportunity arose right before him that day. If this kind stranger would teach him the ways of the sword under his wing, no more would his life be spent at the mercy of others. Right before him was the way to strength, and in turn, true freedom. And it had come in the form of Lean Bean.